Yeah. Big G. Stars. I'm a star. And girl, you a star. She doing tricks with me. She taking pics with me. She making flicks with me. That bitch a movie star. It's a flick on me. Like it's a hit on me. Cause it's a grip on me. I'm a trap star. She doing tricks with me. Yo, welcome back to the Get It Boy Show. It's the Get It Boss. Super charged. And um, you right back. You know what I'm saying? I was actually in, in the process of of editing this last video, the unboxing of my business cards video, you know, but I thought this would be good for the channel, you know, and today I just want to talk about what's hating and what's not hating, you know what I'm saying, like, and it brought, it came to my attention, you know what I'm saying, it comes to my attention every day because, you know, people who know me, who will shake my hand and smile on my face, they will not support my music at all, you see them, some people will, don't get me wrong, some of them do. But I'm talking about majority of them don't fuck with my music. Like they don't, you know what I'm saying? They won't share it. They won't. They won't give it a chance. They won't listen to it. Or none of that shit. And I ask myself, is they really hating, or is they genuinely, or you know what I'm saying, or it, or it's not hating. It's just they don't support. Well, let's see. You know what I'm saying? And it's gonna be a short video. You know what I'm saying? Um, you can engage down in the comments. You know, hit like, share if you feel like. You know, if you feel one way or if you disagree or if you agree, you know what I'm saying? Uh, don't forget to subscribe. But in this video, I'm trying to see what's hating because I remember 2 Chains was on, I don't know if he was on 106 in Park. So, you know, this is about six or seven years ago. You know what I'm saying? Well, he was like, he said that, uh, well, why do it always got to be hating? Sometimes... Why can't it just be not good and it not be hating? You know what I'm saying? And I guess what he was trying to say was, like, everything that people put out ain't ain't good. You know what I'm saying? And it comes to music. But we talking about music in this case, so it don't matter. But, you know, everything, every song somebody put out, it, you know, it, it's impossible for every song to be just good to everybody. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes that music that they put out or that content they put out may be trash, you know what I'm saying? Or just simply not good or just simply, you know what I'm saying? Some 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 artists put out good music all the time, <clears throat> but <clears throat> people don't really pay attention to them. People don't really <clears throat> care about them. You know what I'm saying? They don't really care about them. But another artist puts something out and it could be complete trash and and they, they just gravitate to it, you know what I'm saying? So it, it sometimes it, it's kind of like people gravitate to trash. You know, and I think that got a lot to do with the, uh, this generation that we in right now. But um, going back into it, so what's hating? If I put a song up on on uh, YouTube and I share it to my Facebook, and I don't tag nobody, I just put it up. I put up in the in the caption like, "Oh, subscribe or press play or check out my new song," and all the people who I don't know, they 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 won't click it. They won't click it. They'll just scroll past it. Probably put hide, push hide on the, on the, uh, on the platform so they won't be able to see it on their timeline no more, you know. And uh, and when you know, you know a lot of people that you Facebook friends with. It's kind of like, damn, like, do they not see it? You know what I mean? So it, it, you know, are they hating? You know, are they hating? I say, yeah, in my opinion, I feel like they hating. I feel like that's hating shit because it's one thing for them to to have, to give the music a chance and it just genuinely sound like trash versus them not to get a music a chance at all. You know what I'm saying? And they know me. Now, I can see if this was a case of this loading up slow. This is why I hate making videos on this. I can't wait to get my, my next device in, this iPad, you know. But anyway, you know what I'm saying? I can see if I'm uploading just straight trash and everybody trying to bump it but it's garbage but nobody's giving it a chance this is my thing and people who don't know me give it a chance more than people who do know me and that's why i stopped trying to market my music to people who i know you see what i'm saying because of the simple fact is people won't listen to your music just simply because they don't like you as a person and i'm and I, at one point in my life i was a person that nobody liked 
You know what I'm saying? They didn't like me. It wasn't because, you know, I was a bitch-ass nigga or no shit like that. It was just simply they didn't like me because I wouldn't take no shit. I was just too gangster for them. I was too hard. And they, they you know what I'm saying, they felt intimidated by me. So well, I could see them not fucking with it. But at the same time, if I never did nothing to you directly, I don't understand what you got against me. But, you know, you know, people do, you know, fall into the, to, to the, to the hype like, oh, well, if it's 10 people in the room, and I'm and including me and, you know, five people don't like me in that room, you know, if I don't get to the to the other five to help me, you know what I'm saying, or to be on my side, if I don't convince the other five, the other four people to be on my side, then nine times out of ten, I'm going to be by myself. That's just how people is, you know what I'm saying? People, you know what I'm saying, they like lab, lab rats, you know what I'm saying? They really don't think for themselves when it comes to situations like that. And when it comes to situations like this. So I believe they hating. Yeah, I believe, you know what I'm saying? They see Big Greg face on a on a on a uh on a YouTube video and they completely, you know, just dismiss it. Like, you know what I'm saying? I believe because I know they see it when I share it, and I know they see it when others share it. You know what I'm saying? And they just completely dismiss the song. Like, you know, like I'm not listening to that. He garbage. Fuck him. Now he a lame. He fake. You know what I'm saying? And, and and that's cool if you feel like that, you know what I'm saying? Well, it ain't cool because you will never say that shit to my face. You know what I'm saying? But at the same on the same token, it's like the shit that these niggas do support and do share is motherfuckers who will never get them a dime, who will never look out for them none, who will never front them nothing, who will never talk to them, who will never know them. You feel me? And they'll ride these niggas' dicks like until these niggas get them pregnant. Do you see what I'm saying? So it's like... You know what I'm saying? This is why I feel like it's hating. I, you know, it's the same thing with my cousin them, which I, you know what I'm saying? I ain't biting my tongue no more. You know what I'm saying? I remember I, I had made my, uh, I had, you know, last year I had made, I had just caught my case and I had made a few songs and I took it over my cousin's house so they could listen to it. They would, they saw when they, when they found out it was me, they started leaving out the room. Like first they was like, damn, this shit going. But then when they found out it was me, they started leaving out the room. Like, they was really fucking hating. You know what I'm saying? They, that's really hating shit. All of a sudden, they waving their hands, leaving out the room. I'm like, okay. Like, so, you know what I'm saying? And that's why I came to the conclusion that I need not to be, I don't need to be trying to market my music. Well, not, not, well, yeah, market my music to, to people who know me. Because people who know you is jealous. You know what I'm saying? They jealous. As simple as that. But out the bunch, it's some people who don't got no jealousy in their heart. And they don't get no fuck with nobody. Say, if it sound good, they going to slam it. And it's big ups to them people who think for themselves. You know what I'm saying? Because I got some shit that slam. I got some shit that's all right. And I got some shit that's, uh, could be better. You see what I'm saying? But I wouldn't say none of my shit whack. You see what I'm saying? Because I take a long time process of not putting out whack music. You see what I'm saying? And everything I'm talking about is straight gangster. If you say you gangster, it should be relatable. You know what I'm saying? Then on top of that, you can't say that I'm still in nobody else's style. You know what I'm saying? Because I don't sound like nobody else. And you also can't say that I'm not, you know what I'm saying, that it's not hitting the ear right because I'm riding the beat like a motherfucker. You see what I'm saying? I got one of the most distinct voices out of any rapper in this city. You see what I'm saying? And I'm being myself 100%. So when a, when 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 somebody who know me overlook my music, it don't really make me feel no type of way because I already know what's up. It's just... Simply in my mind, yeah, they they hate. They don't want to hear what I got to say. Which, and if you was the type of person who 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 see my music and you don't give it a chance, and then you see a nigga like Lil Baby, somebody who you will never meet, somebody who you don't know, somebody who never rode with you, never rode for you, and you see his music and you think the same thing, like I ain't listening to that shit either. Then, or if you listen to it, you ain't saying it. But these niggas making famous people more famous. This is what I'm talking about. This is why it's hater shit. Like they, if they feel like, if they feel like it's a possibility that a person that's on their level can surpass them and be on a, a higher level than them, they don't want to be the reason why that happened. They don't want that. They don't want to be the reason why that person goes to the next level. You know what I'm saying? They don't want to be no. They don't want nothing to do with that. You know what I'm saying? They they basically want to see you down. You see what I'm saying? Like, hell no. Like, I'd rather see him down than see him up. But a person that you don't know that's already up, you will give him money. This is the stupid thing. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, my cousin, you know what I'm saying? He he is slammed Migo shit all motherfucking day. You know what I'm saying? 
But he never gave my shit a, 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 a chance. Migos fake as fuck. Them niggas ain't GD, but they claiming that shit. You see what I'm saying? And you know me. You know I'm 74. You know I'm in the streets. You know I'm doing this thing. I'm giving you free dope, nigga. I'm putting money in your pocket. I'm giving you free liquor. I'm kicking it with you every day. And you can't slam my motherfucker. You can't support my business. So, are you hating? In my mind, yeah, you hating. And another point I want to bring up real quick is, uh, before I get to, you know, because we already 10 minute mark. You know what I'm saying? Another point I want to bring up is, I used to see these videos on YouTube saying like, man, or these memes and shit saying like, like you ain't no real friend if you don't tell your homie that he can't rap. What type of shit is that to say? Like, you don't tell no motherfucker like he can't rap. You know what I'm saying? Unless he just genuinely garbage. You know what I'm saying? But just because you don't want to hear him rap, don't mean you put him down. So these bitches be the first ones to say some stupid shit like these niggas dropped out of school to be SoundCloud rappers. Not knowing that SoundCloud can pay you a decent wage if you get your shit popping hard enough. Or they'll say some stupid shit like this nigga, you know what I'm saying, got fired from his job and, and became a YouTube rapper. Not knowing that you can make a living off YouTube. You see what I'm saying? So it's like they don't care about you they want you down if you if you work in a job like them if you struggling like them i don't know how the hell i just whistle like that if you struggling like them if you uh you know what i'm saying if you if you in they shit all day if you hanging with them and you in they face all motherfucking day you know what i'm saying they feel comfortable you see what i'm saying but the moment you try to fall back and do something that you really want to do for your motherfucking self they ain't going to do nothing but reach up and pull you down. And the most notorious group of people by race is black people who do this shit. We is fucking crabs in a motherfucking barrel. You can't you can't do shit. Now, I just mentioned in the last video, which I'm going to put that one up before this one. You know what I'm saying? Hi, this girl, she's supposed to be my homie. She texted me trying to get in the studio. But then when I said that, I could get in at a discounted price. She changed the subject and said, oh, I was trying to invite you to a job fair. That's some bullshit. That's bullshit. You got a job. I don't. You know what I'm trying to do, and you ain't trying to support, but you're trying to get yours in for free. And you're not even taking your music and putting it out. You just want to record the music and listen to the shit. You see what I'm saying? Black people is big crabs in a fucking barrel. Crabs in a barrel. So, I know not to fuck with them. But at the same time, it ain't all black people. It's the black people that you know. It ain't the black people you don't know. The black people you don't know gonna fuck with you. You know what I'm saying? It's like Nipsey Hussle. The nigga who killed Nipsey Hussle was a nigga who knew him. Not a nigga who didn't know him. You see what I'm saying? The same thing with, you know what I'm saying, with Malcolm X. You know what I'm saying? The FBI, the CIA ain't killed Malcolm X. Nigga, the, the Muslims killed Malcolm X, nigga. You see what I'm saying? And that's what, that's the whole point. Like, is it Hayden? You damn right is Hayden. For a motherfucker who, 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 who used to help and put on and ride and do everything a nigga was supposed to be, do, be loyal in every motherfucking way to get zero support. Well, close to zero support because it is some people supporting. I cannot say it's not. To get close to zero support by the niggas who so-called hit you with this, what's up, gang? And shit, that's hating shit. And I can't fuck with you. See what I'm saying? I can't fuck with you. You see what I'm saying? But the only thing that's going to make me get my revenge is my success. That's the only thing. That's the only thing. That's the only way I can pay haters back is to get success. So don't ever get it twisted to the point where, oh, you want to get a person back. Well, you try to hurt, go hurt that person. That ain't going to get them back. That's going to get yourself back because now you worrying, now you got to worry about them coming back or they people coming back or now you got to worry about the motherfucking police locking you up. No, that's stupid. The best revenge is success. If they hating, you know they hating because it's signs of hatred. You know what I'm saying? But it's a lot of people who who got a voice on the internet that shouldn't have a fucking voice. It's a lot of people who got a voice on the internet that shouldn't have a fucking voice. 
a bitch with pink hair could get a million fucking likes just for posting a picture showing her ass. But a nigga who who then rode and protected your block when, so you could be safe when you was a kid, can't get a play on his motherfucking mixtape? Think about that. That's all I got to say. You know, if you don't like what I said, just comment. No matter what you, how you feel, what you think, just do this one thing for me. Subscribe.